today I've had two people contact me and we've had an issue with a uh, both laptops in the situation and what it is there's this version of Microsoft Office called Microsoft Office Starter Edition so what is Microsoft Office Starter Edition it's a crippled version of Microsoft Office pre-bundled with brand name laptops and brand name uh, desktop computers so HP, Asus, Acer, um, typical example, example, sorry, Acer Expire. Okay, so the situation is in both these people that have contacted me is they've got little laptops, um, suddenly they've done a Windows update, you and both people did a Windows update on Windows 7, both using a 3G USB stick and suddenly they couldn't open their documents anymore. They've saved it using this Microsoft Starter Edition. Um, it only comes with uh, Word 2010 and Excel 2010. It doesn't come with um, Outlook, it doesn't come with Publisher, it doesn't come with um, whatever all the other stuff is that probably 90% of the people don't use um, Access for example. So the solutions that I've come up with is either a buy the full uncrippled version of Microsoft Office whatever the latest year version is uh, buy the Microsoft, uh, not Microsoft, sorry, Corel WebPerfect suite uh, which is possibly cheaper um, an online solution is use the free Google um, Office Docs uh, word processor suite um, but of course being on a laptop it's probably not suitable to use that because you need the internet all the time and if you're using 3G stick you don't have much internet so without spending any money the three programs I would recommend is OpenOffice, LibreOffice which um, is a slightly different version of OpenOffice and Libra means open in French, I do believe, or Abbey Word. And Abbey Word is a very simplistic word processor and probably not suitable for everyone, but I personally love it. So I would say to get everyone out of trouble, if you have this starter copy and you want to be up and running really quickly, go grab OpenOffice or LibreOffice they can be found on the internet I will give you the link below portableapps.com have a version that runs off a USB stick now why is that good because um, I actually have my USB stick on my keychain here it runs um, open office off my USB stick it runs Firefox off my USB stick so that means I can go to someone else's computer, someone else's laptop, a library, a job agency, plug it in. If they don't have Office, if they don't have a Breeder, I have also a, a portable version of a, a PDF reader there. I can just load up my document, print it out, and away you go. Um, so yeah, they are the solutions um, I'm offering. HP have an in-depth website you can check out yourself and basically the steps they're saying is you go to uninstall it, you do a repair install and it basically wipes all the registry settings from Windows and starts out the starter edition again from scratch but to be honest it's a crippled version and you'll probably want to use more functionality out of Office anyway and since that came out in 2010 they tried to phase it out in 2013 with a on online office uh, free system so it's probably about time you guys looked into open office or libra office or grabbed the fully uncrippled version which may cost anywhere from 100 bucks to 500 bucks i haven't actually looked at the price of office um, these days but anyway Hope that helps anyone having issues. Um, a system restore will not fix your dramas. This is just going to come up again. 
So, yeah, thank you for watching. Please feel free to like, subscribe, comment below. Your feedback is appreciated. And thank you again for watching. Alrighty, have a great weekend. Thank you.